We're talking with Rohit Arora, the CEO and co-founder of Biz2 Credit out of New York. Rohit, welcome. Well, uh, yeah, thanks for the opportunity. You, you uh, do a great job on getting your name out there, getting your company's name out there. You're a guest blogger for Forbes. I find it interesting that you come up with the Biz2 Credit Index. Uh, you track Main Street borrowings. Tell us about that. What is the Biz2 Credit Index? So Biz2 Credit uh, Small Business Lending Index was launched in uh, January of 2011. And the big reason behind that was that after the advent of the Great Recession, right. uh, we were finding a lot of conflicting uh, views and reports coming in. While next was saying that they had all the money to lend in the world, the small business owners were saying we don't get the money, you know, we are not going to the pool. Exactly, yeah, we've been tracking that supply and demand. The banks are saying, hey, we have all the money, uh, but there's no, no one's knocking at our door, and Main Street is saying, hey, where's, where's my loan? General Motors got their loan, uh, I, we're not getting ours. Uh, good news, we're, this is um, September 6th, Friday, uh, we're starting to see some nice economic news. I don't care what side of the political party you're on, you want to see those, uh, those employment figures going up. Is that uh, similar to what you're seeing in your index? Are things getting better for Main Street, uh, from your view? So, obviously, uh, our small business lending index is showing that things are getting better than compared to 2010, 11, 12. Yes. Uh, uh, but when we compare it with the uh, pre recession, you know, still the availability of the credit for Main Street businesses is down uh, by at least 50%. Right. So, uh, there was a, uh, an article which came yesterday in CNBC. Uh, and talked about the same issue that loan less than a million dollars have fallen down by 19% for the last five years, while a loan above a million dollars has grown by 22% for the last five years. So that clearly shows that the availability of credit to small businesses is still tight. Obviously, it's not better than what it was. Yes, yeah, so that's, yeah. yeah. Good, good, good. Um, how do you get your information for the index? So, this uh, credit uh, has been collecting a lot of data from business owners from all across the country, including their financials, including the bank they bank with, how long they have been banking with, what is the deposit relationship with that bank, and they can try to move their existing deposit bank, they can do. Uh, so, typically, we get around 7 to 8,000 new loan applicants across the country uh, directly wow. through our reference partners. And uh, then what we do is that we take a sample of 1,000 on applicants based on the their US census, uh, uh, the data distribution across the country, more than two years in business, more than six years in credit score. And then we start seeing that, you know, who, who they went to, which bank rejected them, then they came to this credit card. Well, that's, a, the that's a lot of nice data. Rui, briefly, yeah. tell us what this to credit does. What is your business model? So Best to Credit is an online credit marketplace which helps small business owners who don't have any or CFO to uh, get an opportunity to get the best financing products and options for their businesses and help them to execute on Great. So what I mean by that is that we not only help them to see the best matches but also help them to close in on the Great. Rohit Aurora out of New York, thank you for joining us.